Hello guys and welcome back to the crazy minecraft video where today I'm going to be showing you guys something really cool. Now Mark, my friendly zombie is out there waiting for me, but I'm a little bit scared. Because every single time we go and play with Mark our friendly zombie, someone dies. I don't want to die today and I don't want Mark my friendly zombie to die today. So Mark, let's do this. Are you ready to go ahead and play some games? I'm guessing we're going to be doing something about the Wheel of Fortune. Mark, what is this? I've been wanting to play this game with you for ages. Truth and dare. Wait a second. So we're not going to be playing the Wheel of Fortune? Mark, <laughs> that is crazy. Well, guys, I have a feeling Mark is going to go ahead and actually make us shoot some arrows at the Wheel of Fortune, and then we'll get a truth or a dare. Mark, that is actually really cool. We'll take turns in shooting arrows at the Wheel of Fortune to see what we get. We have either a truth or a dare to perform. All the best. <laughs> Mark, don't say all the best as if someone's going to die. That is crazy. Well, I'm guessing I could go first. So let's take out our bow and also our arrow and let's get shooting. You guys ready for this? Here we go. Three, two, one. Let's do this. Guys, comment down below which one is your favorite color and it'll be really cool to find out. My favorite color is going to be... Oh, <laughs> I guess it's dark blue for today. So let's chuck in our bow and our arrow, and let's go and find out what dark blue has. You guys ready for this? Let's do it. So there's a book inside, and it says, Dare, survive in a tsunami of lava. Wait, no! Whoop, hello? Anyone here? Wait a second. This seems to be the old version of our house. It seems like we've been teleported in the past to go ahead and complete this dare. Hello? Mark, where are you, my friendly zombie? This is really strange. Mark, my friendly zombie, never goes missing. Wait a second. Does that mean we've been teleported to this world to complete our dare? Okay, this is really strange. The dare said that we would have to run away from lava. Hmm, this is really strange. As of right now, I don't really see any lava anywhere, so I have a feeling we're doing okay. Wait, guys, look! The lava's coming towards us! This is crazy! It seems to be consuming my house! Wait! No! <laughs> Mark! Where are you, my friendly zombie? This dare is too scary! It seems like it's consuming the whole house and turning every single block into lava. Can I touch it? Let's see. Oh! It seems like I can touch it! This is crazy! Well, whatever's going on, I have a feeling it's gonna turn my whole world into lava, which I don't like at all. It seems to have spread from Mark's house. Mark! Where are you, my friendly zombie? This is crazy! Okay, let's go inside Mark's house. Good. And let's figure out if there's anything inside. Okay, this is really spooky. I don't really want to do this anymore. Hello? Anyone here? <laughs> this used to be Mark's house, and I have a feeling it's now going to go ahead and consume my house. But if it does, it means the whole world will be over. Nothing will survive this crazy apocalypse. But I do think we should be able to make this out alive, right? I don't know, because it's going to consume all our food, and then eventually we'll die of hunger. Nope. <laughs> I can't do this anymore. Mark, take me back to the real world. I'm ready to finish my dare. Oh, and we are back. Mark, we did it. It was insane. You won't believe this. The lava actually came out about here and then I gave up. That was crazy. It really scared me because your whole house got burnt down. But don't worry. I think your house is okay. Let's go and have a quick look. Let's see. Yep. <laughs> The house is doing perfect. Mark, you won't believe it, but I'm kind of glad because my one is now over. Mark, it's now your turn. Go and do a truth or a dare. This is going to be really cool, guys.
had no idea Mark gets jealous of my house. Mark, don't you worry. You can come around my house anytime. Look, I have the sofa that's fit enough for two people. And then my bed upstairs is good for two people as well. So anytime, Mark, you can come and sleep around. It's perfect for us. Well, let me go and do my truth and dare now. So I'm going to get out the bow and also the arrow. And let's do this. You guys ready? So I've done the dark blue one and Mark did the light blue one. So let's go and do any other color. Oh, green. Perfect. Let's put out our bow and also our arrow. And let's go and find out what's inside this green one. Inside we go. And it is a truth. Would you ever want to be an evil zombie? Hmm, that is such a hard question. Let me think. Now, being a friendly zombie is really fun, especially because he can survive in the daytime and he doesn't need any villagers. But would I ever want to be an evil zombie? No, I would never want to be an evil zombie. They are so evil. That's why I kill them. Guys, comment down below if you would want to ever be an evil zombie because I know you wouldn't. So, Mark, let's do this. It's now your turn again. So, guys, let's wait around to see what Mark gets. I'm so glad to be back. Mark, that was crazy. I can't believe you actually spent even just under a minute inside that baby zombie house. I would have been driven crazy and burned down the whole place. But obviously with no baby zombies inside. Well guys, I guess it's my turn. And because it's about to get dark, I do think this should be our last time. So Mark, let's do this. I'm going to get out our bow and also a few arrows. And I'm going to do the purple one. It's my favorite color. I always have to do the purple. So let's go and find out what's inside. So we have a book, and what does it say? I'm a little bit nervous. If it's a dare, it's going to be crazy. And if it's a truth, I don't want to tell the truth. Ah, oh, it's the truth. How many villagers have you ever killed? No, <laughs> I hate this one, but I do guess I have to do it. So let me think. There was that time we were inside the village where there was an evil scientist. Oh, and there was another time when there was an evil villager. Oh, and there was another time where there was an evil golem as well that was a villager. So I'm guessing maybe 200 villagers? <laughs> I don't know. I've killed off so many villagers in my whole time. Mark, how many villagers have you killed? Whoa, that's none. You are doing really well. Well, I have a feeling, guys, I've killed more villagers than Mark, but I don't know how many. So, guys, comment down below how many villagers you think you've killed, and it'll be crazy to find out. Imagine some people having thousands and thousands of villagers they've killed. I've only killed maybe 100 or 200 or maybe 300. I don't know. <laughs> if you guys know how many I've killed, comment down below as well. So guys, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like this video. Subscribe down below, the button is red. And don't forget to press the notifications bell. And as Mark would say, Rah! which means peace out. And maybe next time we can go ahead and do the other challenges, which let me go and show you what they are real quick. So we did the light blue one. We did that one. We did this one. Oh, I don't think we did the pink one. What is this one? It says dare. Survive a normal tsunami with a boat. <gasps> that would have been so cool. Okay, and let's see what other one we didn't do. Or did we do them all? Let's see what the orange one is. 
Dare, a day to survive two minutes in a zombie infested world. Whoa, those would have been so cool. So guys, comment down below if we should do another one of these videos because I love doing them and Mark finds it really spooky as well. So guys, I will see you soon and peace out.